Summer greetings from Canadian Mennonite University. As the days shorten, many, but not all, students have registered already for fall and winter courses. Here's a small sampling of the courses they'll be taking this year. And you're most welcome to see our website for further offerings. Perhaps you know someone who would come alive in these classes, whose voice needs to be heard in them. Or maybe you yourself would like to take one of them, whether for credit or for audit, if you're not looking to write all the papers and such. Consider these, The Art of Worship with Christine Longhurst, The Art of Peacebuilding with Wendy Craker, The Art of Preaching with Andrew Dick. Yes, we do lots of arts. We also have an Art of Math course, although not this year. There's also many courses in science, biology, chemistry, physics, mathematics. I'll feature this one, The Genetic Revolution with John Brubaker. You know, in everyday life, we often hear about genetic modification and we toss around metaphors of cultural DNA. Scientists remind us we need to actually know something about genetics to engage these everyday conversations. I'm really grateful for students who are willing to put in the effort and the time and also students who are willing to take the time to study the Bible and study business and many more areas. Take heart with us in what will happen through these courses. The Biblical Story of Healing and Hope with Dan Aptison, Indigenous Peoples of Canada with Christy Anderson, Financial Accounting, Entrepreneurship and Small Business Management, Health Psychology, Trauma and Resilience, The Future of Community in Sociological Perspective, and a course that's provocatively titled Laugh at the, Dead at Laugh at the Devil with John Bupalin, where he lifts God and laughter up as partners in disrupting oppression and building a health of solidarity. We're grateful for all the students who will engage these and many more courses. Thanks for praying with us throughout their learning and their lives of vocation. God's grace be with you.